U.S. Navy unmanned surface vessel prototype operates at RIMPAC 2024 exercise. At RIMPAC 2024, the largest maritime warfare exercise held in the Indo-Pacific region, the U.S. Navy presented a state-of-the-art innovation in the form of an unmanned surface vessel, USV. This is the first time the U.S. Navy's latest USV prototype has been tested in a joint exercise scenario involving multiple countries. The presence of this vessel is highlighted as it reflects a significant step in the application of more automated and efficient military technology in maritime warfare. RIMPAC or RIM of the Pacific Exercise is a multinational naval exercise organized by the U.S. Indo-Pacific Command every two years, involving dozens of countries and hundreds of ships from different parts of the world. In 2024, with rising geopolitical tensions in the region, RIMPAC is focused on increased collaboration and new technologies, including the use of USVs as a complement to conventional warships and reconnaissance and sea patrol missions. The prototype USV is designed to operate unmanned, equipped with an advanced artificial intelligence AI, system that allows the vessel to navigate and identify targets autonomously. It is capable of remotely executing commands and performing missions without direct human intervention, thus minimizing risks to personnel, which is especially important in combat situations or operations in high-risk areas. In the RIMPAC 2024 exercise, USVs were used to simulate patrol and reconnaissance scenarios, operating alongside manned vessels to ensure effective coordination between machines and humans in a real operational environment. These scenarios involve situations such as detection of enemy vessels, intelligence gathering, and logistical support for manned units. Through this exercise, the USV's ability to recognize and react to threats was tested and evaluated in depth. Experts mention that the operation of USVs at RIMPAC 2024 is a big step towards a more automated and secure future of naval combat. With these unmanned vessels, the U.S. Navy seeks to increase flexibility and effectiveness in dealing with challenges at sea. The USV system can operate for a full 24 hours tirelessly and reduces the need for crews that would normally have to endure long work shifts on time-consuming patrol missions. One of the other advantages of USVs is their ability to operate in extreme weather conditions and in environments that may be too dangerous for humans. This makes them an ideal solution for surveillance missions and intelligence operations in conflict zones or hard-to-reach areas. In addition, the presence of USVs also allows the Navy to respond more quickly to threats or suspicious activity in the waters under surveillance. The development of these unmanned vessels is part of the U.S. military's vision to build a more automated fleet, known as the Ghost Fleet. This concept involves different types of unmanned vehicles, whether on land, sea or air, that will work together in one integrated system. Ultimately, the Navy hopes to create a fleet that is not only physically strong, but also smarter and able to adapt quickly to changes on the battlefield. 
the use of USVs in this exercise also provides important lessons for other countries participating in RIMPAC, many of which are beginning to be interested in developing similar technology, especially for the purposes of border patrol and maritime security. By seeing firsthand the capabilities and reliability of USVs, participating countries can consider how this technology can be adapted in their own defense. On the other hand, the presence of USVs in RIMPAC 2024 also raises questions about its impact on regional stability. Some fear that the use of unmanned technology in military operations could lead to conflict escalation, especially in the event of technical errors or discrepancies in automated decision-making. As these systems are controlled by AI, there are concerns that the ships could make unpredictable and potentially dangerous decisions.